In today's rapidly evolving tech landscape, the realm of robotics has revolutionized the way we interact with and perceive technology. This guide explores the spectrum of modern robotics gadgets worth investing in. From versatile personal assistants to educational kits and advanced home automation devices, this comprehensive overview highlights the top innovations in this field. So let's dive into the video. A new robotic cane, equipped with a 3D camera, sensor, and onboard computer, helps the blind navigate indoors with auditory cues, avoiding obstacles. Developed with funding from NIH, it enhances indoor mobility for visually impaired individuals. Additionally, smart technology has integrated robotics into daily life, offering various robotic gadgets that efficiently manage household chores. Robotic Lawn Mower Manual lawn mowing is no less than climbing Mount Everest. You have to give your time and your efforts to attain a satisfactory result on your lawn. Most of the time, you might even pay somebody else to do it just to get it off your shoulders. On the other hand, a smart lawnmower doesn't need someone to push it around the garden. You only need to switch it on and place it on the surface of the lawn. Then wait and see how it mows the grass cleanly. In this way, you can save a lot of energy which can be used to perform other more important tasks. Modern Autonomous Robots the first electronic autonomous robots with complex behavior were created by William Gray Walter of the Burden Neurological Institute at Bristol, England in 1948 and 1949. He wanted to prove that rich connections between a small number of brain cells could give rise to very complex behaviors, essentially that the secret of how the brain worked lay in how it was wired up. His first robots, named Elmer and Elsie, were constructed between 1948 and 1949 and were often described as tortoises due to their shape and slow rate of movement. The three-wheeled tortoise robots were capable of phototaxis, by which they could find their way to a recharging station when they ran low on battery power. Mobile Robot Mobile robots have the capability to move around in their environment and are not fixed to one physical location. An example of a mobile robot that is in common use today is the Automated Guided Vehicle or Automatic Guided Vehicle. An AGV is a mobile robot that follows markers or wires in the floor or uses vision or lasers. Mobile robots are also found in industry, military, and security environments. They also appear as consumer products for entertainment or to perform certain tasks like vacuum cleaning. Mobile robots are the focus of a great deal of current research, and almost every major university has one or more labs that focus on mobile robot research. Mobile robots are usually used in tightly controlled environments such as on assembly lines because they have difficulty responding to unexpected interference. Because of this, most humans rarely encounter robots. However, domestic robots for cleaning and maintenance are increasingly common in and around homes in developed countries. Robots can also be found in military applications. Modular Robot Modular robots are a new breed of robots that are designed to increase the use of robots by modularizing their architecture. The functionality and effectiveness of a modular robot is easier to increase compared to conventional robots. These robots are composed of a single type of identical, several different identical module types or similarly shaped modules which vary in size. Their architectural structure allows hyper-redundancy for modular robots, as they can be designed with more than 8 degrees of freedom. Creating the programming, inverse kinematics, and dynamics for modular robots is more complex than with traditional robots. Modular robots may be composed of L-shaped modules, cubic modules, and U- and H-shaped modules. ANIT Technology, an early modular robotic technology patented by Robotics Design Incorporated, allows the creation of modular robots from U- and H-shaped modules that connect in a chain and are used to form heterogeneous and homogeneous modular robot systems. Robotic Cleaners When we say home chores, we cannot forget to talk about the most tiresome and the most basic household work, cleaning. The typical vacuum cleaners need you to move them around your house and clean the floors and surfaces by yourself. However, you don't have to face this problem now. All thanks to the robotic cleaners. They can freely move about the house picking up dust particles from every nook and cranny. 
modern robotic cleaners also have Wi-Fi and Bluetooth systems, allowing them to be connected to your mobile phone. You can even set a cleaning schedule, and this gadget will clean your house for you according to that. They come in different forms like vacuum cleaners, pool cleaners, and grill cleaners, all of which make the process easier for you. You can find more options here if you want to buy a smart cleaner for your home. Collaborative Robots a collaborative robot or cobot is a robot that can safely and effectively interact with human workers while performing simple industrial tasks. However, end defectors and other environmental conditions may create hazards, and as such risk assessments should be done before using any industrial motion control application. The collaborative robots most widely used in industries today are manufactured by Universal Robots in Denmark. Rethink Robotics, founded by Rodney Brooks, previously with iRobot, introduced Baxter in September 2012 as an industrial robot designed to safely interact with neighboring human workers and be programmable for performing simple tasks. Baxter stop if they detect a human in the way of their robotic arms and have prominent off switches. Intended for sale to small businesses, they are promoted as the robotic analog of the personal computer. As of May 2014, 190 companies in the U.S. have bought Baxters and they are being used commercially in the U.K. Educational Robots Robots are used as educational assistants to teachers. From the 1980s, robots such as turtles were used in schools and programmed using the logo language. There are robot kits like Lego Mindstorms, BioLoid, OLO from Roboti Ice, or BotBrain educational robots can help children to learn about mathematics, physics, programming, and electronics. Robotics have also been introduced into the lives of elementary and high school students in the form of robot competitions with the company FIRST. The organization is the foundation for the FIRST Robotics Competition, FIRST Tech Challenge, FIRST LEGO League Challenge, and FIRST LEGO League Explore Competitions. There have also been robots such as the teaching computer, Leechim, 1974. Leechim was an early example of speech synthesis using the using the diphone synthesis method. 2XL was a robot-shaped game slash teaching toy based on branching between audible tracks on an 8-track tape player, both invented by Michael J. Freeman. Later, the 8-track was upgraded to tape cassettes and then to digital. Industrial Robots Industrial robots usually consist of a jointed arm and an end effector that is attached to a fixed surface. One of the most common types of end effector is a gripper assembly. The International Organization for Standardization gives a definition of a manipulating industrial robot in ISO 8373. An automatically controlled, reprogrammable, multipurpose, manipulator programmable in three or more axes, which may be either fixed in place or mobile for use in industrial automation applications. This definition is used by the International Federation of Robotics, the European Robotics Research Network, and many national standards committees. That's all for today's video. I hope you found our video interesting and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.